Welcome back to my channel. If you're new here, I'm Carolyn and welcome to another week in my life on the Disney College program. I'm about to have a very dapper week this week. I have today and tomorrow off. I have my Jollywood nights tomorrow and then on Saturday, it's dapper day. So yeah, I'm gonna have a very Hollywood Studios vintage week this week and I love it. But I do need to go shopping for my Jollywood shoes. I have the whole other outfit except for the shoes because I had shoes in my brain because they're back at home in Georgia and they're in Georgia. So now I have to get shoes here in Florida. And I think I'm gonna go do that, but the weather looks disgusting right now. Like it's drizzly and rainy and I don't wanna leave the apartment, but it's like 12 o'clock, so yeah. But it's just gonna be a quick trip. I think just Target and maybe TJ Maxx, like just find something that works with the kitschiness of the Jollywood outfit, which Jollywood is going to be a separate vlog, but y'all should know that because that vlog should have come out already. Like I'll include pieces of it in this week's vlog, but the main Jollywood content is going to be a separate vlog. So this weekly vlog isn't too long. I'm rambling. I kind of want lunch. Should I make myself lunch and then go get shoes? No, because if I make myself lunch, then I'm never gonna get shoes. I'm gonna go get shoes and then make myself lunch. recording what I'm doing instead of just telling you what I'm doing, which I mean, I have to do that to a certain extent because I can't vlog me working. Although I would love to have y'all like with me in the moment, like when I'm trying to close lightning lane, I think that would be high quality vlog content. But um, with starting off the week with my first day off, like with one of my days off this week, I really thought I was gonna be better at vlogging. And yet here I am sitting on the floor of my bathroom monologuing about my day. Because in fairness, I did nothing. I, uh, I vlogged what I did in that I woke up, got ready, did the whole skincare routine for the morning, brushed my teeth, went to TJ Maxx, and then found a pair of shoes there so I didn't have to go look anywhere else for shoes. So I came home and did, um, Nothing. I online shopped. I did a little crochet. I did a little embroidery. I watched some junk TV and it was a good day. But what I should have done is gone to Disney Springs. So now I'm gonna have to do that tomorrow before our Jollywood nights because I realized that this is the last week of November. November ends. Thursday. Thursday is the last day of November. Sorry, I had to mentally go through it in my head. And I don't have the Gideon's card for November, which I have all the other cards. And I'm gonna have to go at some point in December, but I'll probably wind up going when my family's here. So I'm not concerned about December, but I have four days left to get the November Gideon's card. And I really should have done that today, but I didn't think about it until it was like 
seven o'clock at night and I said, well, I'm not gonna, I don't wanna leave the apartment now to go to Disney Springs. So I think I'm gonna go tomorrow. I'm gonna grab the Gideon's cars and I'm going to get the heck out of there. I mean, it's actually, it's not gonna be bad. It's going to be what, like 10 a.m. on a Tuesday. It'll be fine. I just, I have the jumping with night tomorrow. So while this week is not off to an inspiring start for vlogging what I'll be doing, hopefully it will be better with now an impromptu Disney Springs trip, Jollywood nights, and Dapper Day. So I'm sorry that the week started off with me monologuing, and there will be a fair amount of me monologuing throughout the week, but um, I'm, I'm trying to be better. I'm gonna try and be better about vlogging what I'm doing instead of just telling you about it. But this only works when I do things that I'm allowed to vlog about, which does include a trip to Disney Springs, Jollywood Nights, and Dapper Day. And as I said before, Jollywood is its own separate vlog. You know about this already because the vlog came out, but I will, I will vlog it. I will vlog it as I'm doing it. I've gotten in a really bad habit of just monologuing. I've gotten in a rut recently about vlogging, but I'm trying my hardest to get out of it. So hold me to it. Don't let me just monologue for every single thing I do. I mean, I'm gonna have to monologue about work, but don't let me monologue about everything because I only have like, my God, I think I only have like four, no, I have like five or six weeks of my life left. Don't let me monologue everything because I've gotten in a bad habit. Hold me to it. I'll see y'all tomorrow when I'm actually doing things. Also, why have I gotten into finger guns recently? Um, I keep, I don't know why. I, I'm really uncomfortable with the fact that I've gotten into finger guns, but you know, they articulate a point really sarcastically, which I love. So I have made the oh so brilliant late night decision, far too late night decision to do, um pin curls for tomorrow. Yeah, so this is how it's going. But I'm going to look oh so dapper tomorrow night. Only problem is I wanna keep these in at Disney Springs, so I'm gonna have to get real creative. But um, I love that I decided to do this as I was going to bed. springs tomorrow because i really don't want to take them out until i absolutely have to maybe i can shove them in a bucket hat we will see what happens i want to go to bed i hate that the bucket hat actually works um but now we are headed off to disney springs for the fastest disney springs trip of my life they have all the christmas trees up for the christmas tree stroll which i will not be doing today i do want to do it at some point that is not today today is runs to gideon and leave maybe wanders around World of Disney, but pretty much runs to Gideon and leaves. Turns out this trip was pointless today because uh, even though it's November 27th, they are giving out the December card. So I guess I'm not gonna have the November card for my collection then. I mean, it was just gonna go in my sentimental hoarder box, but it's November, why does that say December? I think while I'm here though, I'm gonna stop, get a Starbucks coffee beverage so I can be staying up till all hours of the night tonight because the party runs until 12.30, so let's get caffeination. Can I see y'all? There y'all are, yeah. Let's get caffeination and then head on our merry way back to the apartment. Um, yes please. Thank you. As I said, fastest Disney Springs trip of my life. We're gonna ignore Parks and Rec in the background because who doesn't love Parks and Rec? We're back to looking like a 1950s housewife. Honestly, I pull off this look. I'm not gonna lie, I feel mighty confident right now. But our party is not until very late tonight. The party doesn't start until 8.30. You can't get in with the Jollywood tickets until seven o'clock. We might go earlier because they're not serving like food food during the event they're serving like little snacky things but we kind of want to eat so I don't 
we'll see what happens. Point is, have a significant time to kill. So in the meantime, we're going to work on this lovely lady and, you know, maybe another little crochet crafty project, you know, just keep myself mildly entertained until I need to start getting ready for the night. I'm excited. I'm very excited. But I'm going to relax because tonight's going to be a lot of walking. Sun's starting to set, so I'm going to take that as time to start getting ready. We're going to start with the makeup. We're gonna put on the outfit and then we're gonna do the hair because I'm not messing with these pink curls until I absolutely have to. Based on the dress and the accessories, I'm thinking 1920s, which is going to be interesting because that's not normally a decade I like to replicate or be inspired by. So let's see how this goes for a 1920s inspired Christmas Jollywood Nights look. Decided I'm actually going to do my hair first. So I took off my shirt and put on my robe so I can just like take it off and slip the dress on. Um, wow, I just realized I've been filming over here when I'm over here. But I don't know, is this getting 1920s? Like, I don't know. The problem with 1920s, specifically the lips, it kind of sort, you know, we're maybe given Queen of Hearts. And I didn't want to go full 1920s because that would be like a black smoky eye. And this is a Christmas party. So I don't know. Is this giving 1920s holiday? I promise I'm more enthused than I look, but I'm trying to like, is this 1920s? I tried my hardest. It's not my decade. Let's go disassemble and try to style. Y'all, the kitsch is unbelievable here is the final look um i have another glove it's in my hand and i have a sweater because it's getting down to 54 degrees tonight but here's the finished look and i will see y'all at chocolate nights I can't. I'm I'm obsessed. I'm getting distracted. I have to be at work in approximately nine hours. It is like two o'clock in the morning. My shift today is at 11. 45, it's 11.45, it's 5.45. The one day that I'm not land clearing is the day that I don't get back until two o'clock in the morning. Um, had a blast at Charlotte Nights. I hope y'all enjoyed that vlog because yeah, separate vlog, but y'all got the snippets here. I cannot stop staring at my hair right now. Um, it's two in the morning, I'm delirious. I'll see y'all today. One more, because I seriously can't stop staring. I feel like, I mean, I took my gloves off, but I feel like I'm not bad. I'm just drawn that way. Like, I could be Jessica Rabbit with this hair. I mean, I couldn't be Jessica Rabbit from the neck down, but I've got the hair 
and the 2 a.m. delirious confidence to think I could pull it off, you know? I just realized I left my laundry in the dryer, so guess who's gonna have to do that before she goes to work? Hello, friends. My sincerest apologies. Let me set you down, because I don't want to hold you all this time. Is that a good spot? No. This was a better spot. You're falling now. Okay, I can't do this. There we go. There y'all are. Maybe. Um, yeah, sincerest apologies for yesterday. I'm just gonna keep messing with the camera. There we go. Um, I was walking in like a cloud all day, like one great big sleep deprived cloud. So we know how that ended up. Um, my day was fine at the theater. It was bitterly bitterly cold it was like 50 degrees yesterday and it's gonna be like 50 degrees i mean it is like 50 degrees again today i am ever so slowly getting ready for work how do i still look sleep deprived i slept great last night i'm ever so slowly getting ready for work at the theater i have a 115 to 715 lane clearing today so i did get to sleep in but i'm still taking my time getting ready because yeah, because pajamas. So apologies for yesterday. Nothing remarkable happened. I went to work. It was a slower day because we were so cold and it was all overcast. Today it's cold, but it looks like it's sunny. So I bet we're going to be a bit busier. Um, I don't think I can think of anything of note to add here. And if I think of something, I'll come back to you. Feeling considerably more alive now that I've made myself a cup of coffee, which I acknowledge I maybe should have done yesterday, but I was too tired to even make myself a cup of coffee. So, cheers. And I am off, so I will see y'all after work. I don't know if y'all can tell just how chapped my poor little lips are. Um, it was also bitterly cold and windy today, but it was still sunny. Ooh, let's not get you wet. Um, and I forgot my chapstick at home. So my lips, they literally are so dry and chapped and I slathered them in Vaseline, but they still hurt. I look like Kirsten. <laughs> Did y'all have the American Girl doll? Whenever I have little braids, I do this when I'm bored. Um, I feel like an American girl doll right now. This is a good hair week for Carolyn. Let's take these out. Um, where was I? Chapped lips. They're very chapped. They're covered in Vaseline. Honestly, very good day. I spent 60% of my shift at the exit podium and the remaining 40% land clearing. I had minimal guest interactions today, which is weird because normally, like the guests have to wait with you at the exit podium before they can enter the theater. And normally they have lots of questions, mostly about why they can't answer, enter the theater at that moment in time. And it's because there's another show going. Um, yeah, I, I cannot think of like a single guest interaction I had today other than Oh, you do just need to finish the Starbucks outside. Also, this eye has started itching and I don't know why. And I'm wearing mascara, so like I can't even like itch it. Um, solid day. Waking back up again. Or recovering from being out till like, eh, we were only out until like one o'clock in the morning, but going to bed at two o'clock in the morning for my Jollywood nights. But I do need to go ahead, get in the shower and go to bed because I have a teledoc appointment tomorrow morning. I have to get gas on my way into work and then I have work. So not like a busy morning, but I do have to do like more things than I did today. So I suppose I should do that. I'm like, I like getting in the shower and being in the shower or correction. I like being in the shower and into the nice hot steamy water, but getting in the shower is just the worst. I have to psych up the energy to do it. And I distract myself by monologuing to y'all, which I promised I wouldn't do, so. 
gonna get in the shower. One final thought, whenever I take my hair out of my like super tight braids, um, I always come out of it looking like, um, I didn't want her to change you into a bear. I just wanted her to change you. Like, I feel like Merida. That was like the worst Merida impression ever because I can't do a Scottish accent. But if you had the chance to change your fate, would you? I don't want to go get gas. And yet here I am going to go get gas. which indicates uneventful. I'm, excuse me. I know my Jollywood vlog came out tonight. Oh, and getting gas was fine, except for the fact that the price was like $30 overnight. It was not $30, 30 cents. It was like 280 something yesterday. And today it's like 314. What the heck was that? Because I was very excited to finally get gas when it was $2. I went to go get gas this morning and it wasn't $2 anymore. So that was tragic. But yeah, Jollywood vlog came out tonight, which is very funny to me because my posting schedule is all whack. Like the weekly vlog, the weekly, like, you know, the week of my life vlogs are coming out in order when they're supposed to, but I have little like bonus vlogs like Jollywood that I want to get out before Christmas. Um, so they're coming out way before the week in, my life that they're going to be in so apologies for that i just want y'all to have some fun christmas content before christmas but i don't know why i'm suddenly not very freezing oh i have candy in my pocket look at that um it wasn't as cold today as it was yesterday or the day before but i did still wear my long sleeves but i didn't have to wear my big old jacket at any point but I'm gonna go stand in the hot shower water for a minute because I just stood up after laying on the couch for a minute. And like, you know, when your body, like you start moving again and you're cold. Yeah, that's what's happening right now and I'm freezing. So I will talk to y'all tomorrow where I have in like seven and a half hour shift. I don't know, it's 11.45 to 7.15, whatever length that is. In a rather impromptu turn of events, I have to go to Flamingo Crossing before my shift starts. Next week is the fall uh, Disney program celebration and it's going to be at Animal Kingdom. But in order to attend, you have to pick up um, a wristband and they only give those out at Flamingo Crossings. Well, my wristband came in last night and this is literally the only day that I can pick it up before the event. So yeah, we are going to Sorry, thought I saw something. I was just hallucinating. I have to go to Flamingo Crossings to pick up my program celebration packet. I think there's a couple snack coupons in there that can only be used like the night of the event. I don't know. I, I never know what's going on, but let's go to Flamingo Crossings and then we'll drive into Animal Kingdom for question mark shift length. Success! Alrighty, picked up my packet and my wristband. Evidently today was also a traditions day because Flamingo Crossings was hopping. Oh, I've gotta unlock my car. Things are falling. There we go. Um, yeah, traditions was apparently happening today at Flamingo Crossing. The place was busy. I keep dropping things. We're coming back to this. Okay, everything is now in the car where it is supposed to be. Had success, picked up the program, celebration, packet with my wristband. So now I can officially attend. Flamingo was busy because today was traditions for the group that apparently moved in on Monday. I did not know a new group moved in on Monday, but CP's pretty much move in every single Monday. 
and now I'm headed to work. But I think if the previous video clips have proven anything, I need a Coke. I'm home significantly later than I thought I would be. Had a meh day at work. Nothing remarkable happened. Um, was I inside? I was inside for the four o'clock chalk show. I was the main usher for the four o'clock chalk show. I haven't been main usher in like a month. So that was a fun little challenge exercise, you know, re learn it, not even relearning, you know, just like being made usher sure again after a month. Land cleared, um, land clearing took a bit longer than normal just because there was an event group in Africa tonight. I think it was a vow renewal. Someone had rented out Africa for a vow renewal because when we went in the theater at the end of the night to like get our stuff, um, they were setting up like a wedding reception and it looked really pretty. But we walked in and we were like, who's getting married in the theater? With no chance of rain. Normally, like the groups will, people get married in Africa all the time because it's really pretty at night. And generally people have their things outside, but then it will get moved into the theater if it's like going to rain. But there was no chance of rain and they were just setting up inside, which is a little different than usual, but it still looks nice and they had show lighting going. A guest gave me this friendship bracelet while I was land clearing. I told him have a nice night and she said, here, this is for you. And it says, is this backwards when you're reading it? It says, scar, because Lion King. Actually, I don't think she even knew I worked at the Lion King. She just said, here, this is for you. And it says scar on it and it's like, orange and black, you know, like he is. So yeah, I got a friendship bracelet at work today. Um, but I'm home later than I thought I was going to be because about like an hour before my shift ended, Kelly was like, you wanna go sit on the floor of my apartment and watch Bluey? And I'm like, of course I want to watch Bluey. So sat on the floor of her apartment for like hour and a half, two hours watching Bluey with Tyler and Kelly uh, as Leah didn't come tonight because she wanted to spend some time with her puppy. But yeah, now I want to get in the shower because I'm cold. Also, I don't think I'm gonna go to Hollywood Studios for Dapper Day tomorrow. Like, I still can. I'm just very tired and don't have anything to wear because I spent the money that I was going to spend on a Dapper Day outfit, on a Jollywood outfit. So, yeah, we'll see if I wind up going. I still have Hollywood Studios reservations, but I also go into work tomorrow, but I'm not in until 3.15. So it would be like a quick Dapper Day trip, like a take pictures and leave trip. But I can take pictures looking dapper at Hollywood Studios anytime I I don't know. I'm logicking through, I'm vocalizing my thought process right now. When it looks like my shower water is sufficiently warm, so I'm gonna go put this up, take this out, and go to bed. Or get the shower and go to bed, but y'all know what I mean. Mm. Happy Saturday, guys. I decided not to go to Hollywood Studios today, as I'm sure you can tell. Instead, I decided to enjoy the fact that I don't have to go to work. Why am I filming up there? There I am. Instead, I'm enjoying the fact that I don't have to go into work until 3.15. So I'm being crafty. She's getting there. She's almost done. I mean, she's done. I have to finish her accessories. And then I can assemble the whole thing. I'm also doing some Christmas shopping because it is December 2nd and I still need to get one, two, three, four Christmas presents for people. So I need to figure out what to get them. So I figured I would take my delayed start as an opportunity to do several things and mostly just stay in my pajamas until like 
two o'clock in the afternoon. I am headed into my event shift. I got princess parking. It's gonna be a good shift. Where am I going? That's where I'm going. Regular post shift activities. Hi guys, we're gonna be super quick and super quiet because it's like 1.30 in the morning. Um, the event shift was really fun. The event actually seemed like they wanted to be there. Could be because they had an open bar right outside the theater, but you never know. They didn't know it was because of the open bar. Um, and then we didn't get off until 9.15 and we didn't make it back to our cars until like 9.30. So then Tyler and I went to McDonald's and I got myself a Happy Meal and then we sat in her car from, um, 10 until 1 in the morning <laughs> just talking honestly we were it was just really fun it was really nice to just sit and talk forever but now it's one o'clock in the morning and the week has ended and i'm just going to shower in the morning so i threw on my pjs i'm gonna go crawl into bed so we are going to end this vlog here i hope you all enjoyed following along another week in my life i'm sad i didn't go to dapper day but i did have my jollywood night this week which is really fun i have some really fun animal kingdom stuff planned next week mostly related to working at animal kingdom but like i'm not actually going to be working like i will be able to document this one stuff so yeah you know what is it i have a like scavenger hunt murder mystery game something on wednesday next week no that's on thursday and then i have the disney program celebration on wednesday so yeah being quiet it's one in the morning i've already said that it's one in the morning i'm tired i'm delirious Hope y'all enjoyed following along another week in my life on the Disney College program. We are definitely getting down the home stretch here. Um, I don't know how to link that to this next part, so I will see y'all again real soon. Bye!